What is up guys, it's me Vlad and today we're going to showcase the Moon Client mod menu. This is probably the most OP mod menu you can get right now. I got this menu for free, to be honest. Um, I didn't buy it and I don't support buying the mod menus. Although, I won't spread it uh, myself, so guys, uh, uh, I just don't want to get in any beef with the mod creator. And uh, yeah, this is just a showcase of the menu, but if you want a similar mod menu, uh, which has similar features, I would recommend the, the GTAG Kids mod menu, which actually you can find the method for in my Discord. So join the Discord, link is in the description. Actually, it has some of the features that this mod menu doesn't have, for example, head spin and stuff like that, uh, which works not only on the client side, but other people can see it. But today we're going to review the Moon Client mod menu, and uh, yeah, let's start uh, with it. Basically, I'm going to go into modded lobby over here, and hopefully there won't be any sound spammers, but whatever. So first of all, we have disconnect. So we can actually disconnect from a lobby, as you can see. I disconnected, join public, random public, joins random public lobby. Um, like usually, as you can see, chance, which is our mod menu button for, first of all, and it swatches the hands, basically. On this uh, hand, usually when we open up the menu, it's X or this button right here. And on this, uh, basically, hand, it's... Uh, basically X here, or it's Y, I don't know, X I think. Basically, once we switch, uh, the button switches, and uh, the hand which we use it on switches too. So flip menu, I actually like this layout, that uh, all of the stuff related to, to how the menu looks is on the first page, pretty neat, pretty neat layout. Platforms, really cool too, because uh, it's on the first page, and we can actually, uh, get the platforms way easier okay so i'm in the lobby as you can see i'm on the only one in the lobby yep okay so next thing we have is invis platforms so it's invisible platforms right here uh as you can see we cannot see the platforms but uh, all of the platforms are on the grip button next thing we have trigger to no clip so Actually, let's get our platform so we can no clip and I would recommend getting platforms with this because if you want to if you don't want to crash the game and fall to your death, uh, I would recommend um, basically getting platforms and or fly at least with it when you enable it. It's on the trigger by the way. Long arms, long arms, they're kind of buggy. So basically uh, when we use the long arms, uh, the arms are long as you can see. Not as long as on the quest, but whatever. But basically, if we disable long arms, it keeps it, basically. So the long arms are kept long, even if it disables uh, the mod, or even if you disable the mod, but whatever. Uh, it, it doesn't hurt you in any way, but whatever. Okay, flight. Or actually, yep, flight. Uh, flight is on the Y button, or... Yeah, or this button right here. So you press on it and you can fly. Yeah. Pretty usual fly. Hello, hello. I don't know why his face is red. I mean, this bugging on the stack. Next thing we have is TP gun. TP gun. Yep, as you could see. Yeah, also, I don't want to spread this mod menu because it's too OP. Um, but uh, whatever. So yeah, TP gun. This TP gun actually works. Yeah, as you can see, even on the other side of the map, doesn't TP you through any of uh, the. Basically, it doesn't no clip. I mean, it makes sense if it no clipped, you would get off the map. But whatever. Actually, no. If uh, if, if it no clipped through everything, like on the map, uh, actually, it wouldn't really work. Yeah, because for example, if you actually. If you no clipped through everything, basically besides the target, it will work, I think. But whatever. Um, when you TP, I meant. So anti tag freeze, basically tag freeze is disabled uh, once uh, everyone gets tagged, at least only for you. But uh, yeah. 
Next thing we have is checkpoint. So you leave a checkpoint on your grip button on every mod menu. By the way, if you want a great mod menu, uh, I would recommend uh, or uh, you could get Shiba's menu Y that came out yesterday. I basically uploaded a mod menu showcase yesterday and uh, you can find a method on how to get it in my Discord, although I, I don't spread myself so yeah i don't spread any of the mod menus myself and i don't recommend them and basically i don't promote them i just showcase them in my videos and uh, yeah i just wanted to clear that out of the way and if anyone uses the mod menus it's fully on him basically the responsibility okay so um uh, yep it's so i don't get any illegal troubles but checkpoint you just press grab button it leaves the circle right here and we teleport to it with our trigger but uh, you don't teleport through stuff as you can see uh, it doesn't have no clip built into it so yep and it keeps the momentum and also once you for example i leave this uh, checkpoint right here if you disable it it doesn't uh, get rid of the circle uh, which is uh, i don't know it's kind of weird I wish, uh, it's pretty much the same thing on every mod menu, though. Okay. Next thing we have a speed boost. The speed boost works. Um, kinda. Not the best speed boost, but uh, does its job. Although with long arms, I don't really notice it. Uh, but whatever. We're gonna assume it works. Mega fly. So it's fly on the same button. Uh, but it's really fast. Uh, I kind of like this fly more. Uh, but whatever. Okay, next thing. Mega speed boost. Yeah, this is the speed boost that I'm talking about. Pretty good. Uh, you can actually notice it. And yeah, let me know in the comments, guys. What do you think about this mod menu? Basically, because I think it's good. Although, by the way, I just uh, had an idea. I'm going to give the mod menus a rating after each showcase basically so i'm going to rate e every mod menu that i'm going to showcase basically on the channel uh but yeah uh vibe platforms uh platforms are rgb but uh, there's no red so they're kind of vibe i like this color scheme I like the pink purple and blue pretty neat then we have YB platforms too. Okay, it's switched the pages. Um, YB platforms too. So it's uh, blue and green and red. Yep, blue, green, and red. Uh, yeah, um, that, I'm the only one in the lobby, but that means I won't actually disrupt anyone. Okay, sticky platforms. So they're platforms, but sticky, so you can actually maneuver your hands, whatever you want, to maneuver them, or whatever direction you want to maneuver them, but uh, if you hold the grip button, you cannot move. Whatever. Hopefully you understood it, man. Build platforms, these are really annoying. Hopefully I won't break my game, but if you usually use them, um... Basically what it does, it, it builds platforms, but they don't disappear. So, for example... Oh my god, man. I'm stuck. My hand is stuck, man. No. Yeah, and you cannot no-clip through them. Oh, actually, let me try... Yeah, I cannot get out. I'll have to reload the game, but you can trap people with them. I don't recommend doing that, but it's really annoying. And frustrating, but actually, let's restart the game real quick. Okay guys, we're back. I wish the build platforms feature had um, basically one button to remove all of the platforms though. It would have been way better with it, but I guess not. Uh, whatever. So let's uh, get straight to back to our review. So, right here we have... Uh, um, where are we? Oh, we're at trigger platforms. So, there are platforms on the trigger buttons, on these buttons right here. As you can see... Um, actually, let's go to modded. Yeah, we're modded. And let's go back here. So, as you can see, they work. Uh, they're kind of sticky halfway. Uh, or half of the time. Yeah, I'm the only one in the lobby. Okay, 
Next thing we have is Invis Trigger Platforms. So, there are platforms on the trigger buttons, but they're on Invis, basically. Um, they kinda... They're kinda sticky. Uh, but it's half and half of the time, so... Circle Platforms. Platforms on the grip buttons, circle -y, you could see. Um, although, they're re they're pretty much sticky. Uh, it doesn't matter, uh, basically, how much you do it. They're sticky all of the times, but... The right circle is bigger for some reason. Actually, we got in the lobby, but whatever. Okay, next thing, or actually people got in my lobby. Next thing, we have um, trigger to go in viz. We can actually test it out now. As you can see, on the trigger, we go invisible. And I have the tag freeze. Yeah, as you can see, people don't see me, I'm pretty sure. Don't they? They can hear me, though. But uh, they don't see me. Actually, I want to get in front of uh, someone, but whatever. Next thing we have is Ghost Monkey. So you leave a Ghost Monkey. Actually, you just press on the button. On uh, this button right here. The uh, I don't remember what the name of it is, man. Let me actually see it. Mm, the so it's the Y button on the left controller. And uh, basically, you leave your monkey, as you can see, hanging around, and people see it that way too. Um, uh, but whatever. So, next thing we have is RGB, works only in stump, and uh, if you're not tagged, but since I'm tagged and I'm not in stump, it won't work. Um, but whatever. I'm not going to test it out. Most of RGBs work, usually, in the mod menus. So I'm going to assume this works. And strobe was too. Strobe was just uh, faster with uh, basically faster pacing colors. RGB. And uh, the colors are more bright, I would think. Uh, but yeah. So, next thing we have is AC 130 gun. And uh, basically you can hold the grip button teleport somewhere and it uh, just uh, teleports you out of the map and I kind of hate it. YB platforms, let's get back to them. Let's get to this guy on the tutorial real quick. He won't expect it but yeah. Bams, man. Hello, hello. He has the icicle, cool man. Uh, I'm going to leave the YB, actually no. It will probably have more stuff on the grip buttons so I'll, I'll turn it off. Uh, trigger to x-ray so we can x-ray once we trigger okay that scared me a bit but we can see where everyone is on the map yeah, as you can see there's that guy there's that guy there's that guy and uh, yeah and uh, there's this guy which i don't know what he's doing probably pretending to be pbvv uh, but who cares next thing we have is Beacon. So everyone, I actually never show this uh, in the mod menus the showcases. As you can see, people have beacons. I don't actually think that. Uh, I'm not sure. We can actually test it out real quick. But I'm not sure if they are. Yeah, you can go through them. Or actually, no. You can. Um. You can bump with them. Yeah. You could see my game is kind of lagging for some reason. It's, I think it's my air link, but whatever. Um, let's go next. Uh, grip to fake lag. So you can flip fake lag on grip button. It doesn't actually lag anything. It just teleports you back and forth. So for example, if I go next to this guy, I don't think he cares enough. But if we go to this guy, as you can see, he sees us. And we kind of teleport in the way. And uh, he sees it, so... Eh, actually, I don't know if he sees it, but whatever. Let's actually go up to this guy, as you can see. Yeah, he probably sees it. Yeah, whatever. But it's on the left grip button, not on the right one. So yeah. Next thing we have is slow time. So it slows the time for you. Basically, it's like gravity. Low gravity, I would say. Eh, I don't know. Actually, I don't know what it does. Yeah, I think it's low gravity. Uh, let's go next. So you have more air time. Speed time. Okay, we go up. Yep. Not, not gonna go. Hey, 
Yo, yo, no, no, no man. Speed time, disable. Yeah, we're falling, man. Yeah, just, uh, I don't know, it just puts you up for some reason. Uh, next thing we have is replay. So, replay, we place a checkpoint somewhere and we teleport. Actually, let's try it with this. Yeah, on this button right here on the grip, no, on the trigger, you basically press on one time and you get sent back and replay everything you did. I don't know, I think. I'm not sure what, what button it is, though, but whatever. Okay, next thing we have is the square monkey. So everyone is a square. Actually, it's uh, there is this thing in the shibas menu, as you can see, which I didn't showcase the last time. Uh, but everyone is a square, and uh, yeah, actually, let's uh, do the trigger to x-ray, and I'll show it to you. Actually, it doesn't work with the trigger to x-ray. Um, oh, I need platforms real quick. I want to see if it works like this. I think the guy just left. Did he leave? Um, I think so. Yep, whatever. So next thing we have is... Uh, where is it? Where is it, man? Where is it? Yeah, so we cannot test Square Monkey. Actually, you saw it for one. Okay, guys, my air link disabled for some reason. I don't know, did the, the same thing in the last uh, basic video. Uh, but whatever. So, we cannot test out uh, Sphere Monkey. Uh, but you saw the square monkey uh, for a split second there, uh, but whatever. Basically, just to mix every gorilla in a sphere, or in a square, or whatever you pick. Uh, but yeah, follow random doesn't work. I tried it, doesn't work, didn't work, yeah. Hide in trees, so you can go in trees, as you can see, other stuff has colliders, but the trees themselves don't have colliders so you can hide in them and uh, yeah you can also uh, I think it's a great uh, combo you can just uh, use ghost monkey for example leave your body in the tree and uh, just uh, choke people uh, it doesn't hurt anyone but as you can see uh, I kind of didn't hide that well maybe if we do this kind of uh, you won't be able to see yeah you cannot see me, as you can see, and you can like teleport bumps, as you can see, and uh, you're back in your body. So, next thing. Next thing we have is a wall walk. So, uh, it's detected, so pretty much don't use it in any of the pubs. Don't use any mods in pubs. It's just lame. And, uh, yeah. As you can see, it kind of reminds me of Monkey Mischief movement. So, you get uh, sent to every wall it sees. And it kind of works with floor, which uh, usually uh, this type of mod doesn't work with. So, um, but whatever. So it works with everything. I'm pretty sure it works with this too. So, yeah, as you can see, I get mag like magnetated to it, if that's a word, but whatever. Yeah, it works with trees. Should work with trees. Yeah, as you can see. Got sent to the tree. And it works with these. Too, as you could see, eh. should work technically, yeah, but there, it's kind of weird. But whatever, pretty cool. Trigger to wall walk, I found this way better because you can control when you want to wall walk. Oh, well, actually, it doesn't work. Yeah, it doesn't work. Just, or either wall walk didn't disable. No, wall walk disabled, but wait a second. Yeah, you just wall walk, and it doesn't work. Next thing we have is Big Monkey. So, Big Monkey doesn't work, I guess. Or it's like, no, it doesn't work. I'm in the lobby, so it doesn't work. Trigger to Big Monkey doesn't work. On the Shibos, it worked. Or the Small Monkey at least worked. But everything looked big, so I guess it's the same thing. Tagal Hunt, don't use it, but uh, it's in Hunt. Tag Gun, Tagara, uh, Tagora works, I'm pretty sure. Doesn't ban you. Um, but yeah, I don't know about the rest of the stuff. It, uh, at least it doesn't ban you in privates, because I tried it with my friends. Um, who didn't mind me using it, uh, because they knew it. And it worked, uh, but yeah. 
I don't know about the rest of the stuff. Probably Tagon is the same thing. Tagora basically puts a big circle, um, like circle area next to you, and the people in that circle just get tagged, I think. Okay, Sound Spammer Master. I won't use that. It's really annoying, and I don't know. I think you get banned either way. By the way, guys, I have a mod menu with an anti ban. And I may review it sometime, I may showcase it, but uh, yeah, it pretty much has an anti-ban so you don't get banned, um, and it's real, and it's not the moon kind. It's made by the Gorilla Tag uh, Kids, Dev, and a few others, uh, but yeah, have an early access to it, which is pretty cool. Okay, next we have uh, Kick Gun, out of Stomp. Yeah, log all, don't use that, really annoying and bad, break game mode, don't use that, it's all detected, turn room private, this works, so if we go here, although I'm pretty sure it's client sided, I'm not sure if it is, but last time I checked in the private lobby with my friends, um, they didn't see it, I guess it just uh, does it for you, so turn private, turns it to private, turns it to public, turns it to public, you could see. Pretty cool. Um, next thing we have is actually... Oh, by the way, these are on the Shibos menu. I'm pretty sure, uh, from what I know. And... Uh, on the Shibos mod menu, they're detected. I don't know about this, but uh, yeah. As you can see, I didn't get banned. Okay, next thing is Dinner, Bo Dinner Bone Monkey doesn't work. And it uh, doesn't work for other people too, if I know correct. If I know my things correctly. Okay. I cannot speak properly. Sorry for that. Uh, let's actually get our Vibe platforms real quick. I like the first ones more. So if we go here and uh, we disable forest. Uh, actually, no. We got too far. Uh, if we delete forest. As you can see, it deletes the forest. And uh, the stump doesn't get deleted. We need to enable it real quick. Um... Oh, and the forest gets disabled for good, I think. Yeah, pretty sad though. Um, okay, next thing we have is uh, delete stump. I'm not gonna do that because I won't have any textures. To, basically, yeah, at all. So, I will fall and uh, it will be impossible. Besides me sitting on the platforms to actually review them at me. Okay, guys, I reloaded my game because you weren't able to see most of the mods uh, working when I basically deleted the forest. Uh, but I reloaded my game. Everything will work now. And yeah, let's uh, join the modded lobby real quick. And uh, yeah, actually, we need to be in stump. I'll, see, I'll show you the mirror, guys. Let's go to the page. What page we were on, I don't remember, man. Uh, I think we are on this page, yeah. So, sticky everywhere, or name stealer gun, for example, as you could see. My uh, name is uh, Hi Monkey, and uh, this guy's name is. Wait a second, man. Uh. Wa something wawa cat. So I press the grip button, I press trigger, and as you can see, I'm the wawa cat now. So, um, basically, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, and it doesn't hurt anyone. This mod is uh, pretty cool, just uh, to try with your friends and stuff like that. Don't use it to annoy people, though. I don't know how you can actually. It's just a cool trick. Next thing we have is. Um, sticky everywhere. So only for you, it's pretty much like Jupiter Walk or uh, Tag Freeze, but everything is sticky, so you cannot go up that much. Uh, but yeah, as you can see for other people, it's fine. So it's um, client sided. Mirror to cosmetics. Let's actually go up to the stump real quick. I'll get my uh, platforms. Uh. Actually, I missed the uh, trigger to slingshot. So slingshot is on the right controller. You hold it, it's fly, or on the right trigger, you hold it, it it's fly. But um, basically, uh, with the velocity or with the time increases the velocity. So if you hold it for a while, uh, you get way faster. Man, I had to dis I have to disable the thingy real quick. My uh, 
my thingy isn't disabled, man. What is it called? Sticky everywhere. Sticky everywhere. Still, oh man. I don't think it disables, whatever. Hopefully, we'll get to our stump real quick. Actually, yeah, I found a way, man. Yeah, as you could see, in stump, if we go here. Man. It's so annoying. We go here. Mirror next to cosmetics works. You could see my name. Yep. Uh, pretty cool. Next thing we have is OG stump. So the stump is OG. We got those thingies right here. They got colliders. Yep. As you could see, pretty cool. Oh, actually, after everyone got tagged, maybe it was someone else doing the tag uh, sticky thingy. But I don't know. But uh, the colliders have there. There are colliders on these things. So this is like the OG, the old stump. It's pretty cool. But Lemming, I'm pretty sure, got rid of this because he thought that uh, uh, it was just basically too hard for new buys to pass this and get to the stump. But yeah, man, everyone gets tagged. It's so annoying. I can just enable the tag freeze, but it's, uh, I'm too far in the menu, man. Let me get here, man. Can I beat it real quick? Okay, man. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's pretty easy, honestly. Pretty good of a challenge, though. So, next thing we have is uh, kick gun, rejoin, out of stump. So you rejoin and then you kick people out of stump. You have kick gun, stump only. I'm not going to showcase these. I'm pretty sure you get banned. Or, I don't know, maybe not. Who knows? Small monkey. So everything is big for you. You're really small and it's really cool. Um, I don't know how I look though. Actually, let's get the mirror real quick here. We'll see. Man, eh, eh. Not here, man. Page 10. Oh, uh, page 9, man. Uh, small monkey. Or actual mirror. How do- Yeah, I, I look pretty funky. It's, it's pretty much client-sided, I'm pretty sure, because no one noticed me. Okay, next is grip to small monkey. It's the same thing, but on grip. So, we change to small monkey. When we press the grip, we change back once we disable the grip. So you can see someone's flying somewhere. Pretty cool. Xerox spam, not working. Yeah, it says Xerox spam, but it's not working. I don't know what it does. Rock spam doesn't work. Uh, rock gun um, doesn't work. I don't know what rock gun does. Oh my god, I disabled my mod menu, man. I have to reload my game again. Okay, guys, we're back. Um, yeah, broke the menu. If you go past the 12th page, you break the menu, which is pretty unfortunate. And uh, yeah. Okay, next thing we have, I think we stopped on the rock gun. So we have Spider Monkey, haven't seen this in a while on the mod menu because I mainly reviewed Shiba's mods and stuff like that, and yeah, they don't. Oh my god, man, I broke the menu again. Gonna have to reload the game again, man. <laughs> man. Uh, the frustrating thing is that when I exit Girl Attack, I have to... When I open it up again, I have to actually go up to my PC and get select the on-screen, basically, Steam VR view, because uh, you see me in the third person, and it's not really fun. Okay, guys, we're back again for the 20th time. Let's go to the page where we were on. So, I think we were on this page. Not, we're not going to the next page, man, until we get through this page. So, we go to the modded lobby, we join, and bam, spams, we're in the modded lobby. Pretty cool, man. So, we got Spider Monkey. Spider Monkey. Yeah, the monkey is like spider. Pretty cool mod. On the Shibas mod menu, there's no Spider Monkey. I wish it was there, but it's not. And I wish Spider Monkey kind of... Um got you up more and not just uh it wasn't just like slow swinging uh but it's cool there should be a game like uh, girl attack with a girl attack movement but uh, you're the spider-man i don't know that would be pretty sick but maybe i should make that game let me know in the comments guys okay next thing is iron monkey so iron monkey uh, doesn't work i guess Yep, doesn't work. Usually it works. Usually it's just uh, like thrusters under you and you go booms and you go up like fly. 
Um, up and down, up and down, up and down, and yeah, I'm not going to go out of the map because, uh, I mean, for a second I can. Bam, go down, go up, go down before I get kicked. It also does a pretty cool thing here with the mics. Lean bomb doesn't work. Lambo monkey, car monkey, yeah. Um, pretty much. You just go forward, go backwards, uh, and you can control it uh, using your camera. You pr basically use your stick to uh, drive. Okay. Next thing we have is the final thing. Better slide control, better slide control on the ice map, on the mountain map, whatever you call it. Yep. Black hole, you leave a black hole, you get teleported to it. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. You know, kind of reminds me of the replay, but uh, yeah, you get teleported to the black hole. So we have kick on motors. I don't know if this works. I don't know if this gets banned or if this gets you banned, but whatever. Name changer kicks out of the game. So it kicks you out of the game. Lobby side selector doesn't work anymore. I'm not comp. I'm not sure if it works. Whatever. And okay, guys. So we got to the end of the menu. Uh, I'm not going to break it, but. Let me actually give this menu a rating. So, we take off one point because you can break the menu by going to the 12th page. And that's kind of a bummer. So, we take one point off of 10. Next thing we have is uh, most of the mods honestly are on the Shibos mod menu. And on Girl Attack Kids, uh, they probably... Uh, I'm not sure if they skid it. Probably, who knows. But uh, yeah, they're free. And this mod menu is like 25 bucks or something like that. And I don't support the, like, selling menus and stuff like that, so taking off two points, or actually, yeah, probably, like, two to three points off of that. And this leaves us with a rating of seven. So, seven, pretty cool mod menu, although most of the features are on the other mod menus already. Let me know in the comments, guys, what rating you give this mod menu yourself. Basically, this will be our, uh, this will be instead of our end of the video phrase, so let me know in the comments, guys, what rating you give this mod menu. And I'm kind of evolving. I, I'm bad at, like, wall climbing, but, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll learn it soon. But whatever, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe, because I upload mod-related, uh, or Gorilla Tag modded, mod-related videos every day, and I'm sorry for my bad use of the language because i'm ukrainian and uh, my english isn't that great so i'm an ukrainian immigrant and my english isn't that great so sorry for that and if you want to get the shibos mod menu if you want to find a method on how to get it or the gorilla tag kids mod menu join my discord the link is in the description although i won't distribute this mod menu and uh, yeah see you later guys bye bye and don't forget to subscribe because i upload daily v videos about mods basically and gorilla tag and you get the latest news about mods and the you basically know the most op mod menus yeah every day but thank you for watching the video, have a great day, see you later guys, bye bye, and actually, I forgot something guys, don't forget to comment something down below, because if you don't comment man, I'll come to your house and eat, or eat your pil pillow man, pillow man, I cannot pronounce the pillow right, uh, I don't know if I pronounce it right, but yeah, well, this guy's pretty scary, he's using platforms, yeah, see you later guys, bye bye, and yeah. By the way, guys, I just wanted to point out why I say to comment down below every single, basically, time in every video. It's because uh, if you comment, YouTube thinks that my video is interesting, so it recommends it to more people. And I really like to engage with you guys in the comments, and I like and respond to all the comments. So yeah, see you later, guys. Bye-bye.